guys, today we'll be doing a new review of a new character. Uh, yeah, he's gonna cost you 500 to place down. <clears throat> 500 to place down. He's from the brand new update I just got. I mean, that's what he looks like. Uh, shoot. Okay. Anyways, he'll be doing about 459 damage, 8 range, and 2.1 cooldown for the first level. Uh, first upgrade's gonna be 300. And now it's 764 um, damage. So like a 200, maybe 300 uh, damage buff. Not the best, not the best. Uh, just to make sure we find it. Yeah. Okay. All right, for second upgrade, it's gonna be 900. So <clears throat> yeah, just get that. 1,300 damage, so not bad. 1.6 cooldown, not the best for sure. Definitely not the best. Uh, could be better. Next upgrade, 1,500. Ooh. Okay, only 500 damage move boost. Jeez. Uh, definitely not the best. Not the best. Uh, 2,500 for the last upgrade, which actually that's pretty pricey actually. Uh, get it. 3,000, dude. That's a huge damage uh, upgrade. 1,700. So, 1.1 cooldown, so not bad. He will be, like, look at this. Just cleaning up. I'm surprised he's able to do this. Like, hit it. Like, his cooldown's not bad at all. Okay, let's see how many you can place, though. So, that's two, three. We'll be able to place five. Ooh, it looks like we will. Yeah, five. But it, otherwise, it doesn't seem like he has any other uh, special abilities. But if you're playing through the game, uh, yeah, sure, get him. If, if you're playing through the game, if you already beat the, if you already beat like classic mode and all this stuff, I don't really recommend getting him. He's cool. He does a decent amount of damage, but nothing too exciting. Uh, yeah, he's a pretty cool unit. You can, the fact that he can place five of them is five of him is pretty cool though. So, yeah, see you guys later.